Hello everybody, welcome back to 7 Days. We are in the Prepocalypse mod. We are on day 43 of Urban Prepper. And today, I'm not exactly sure what we're gonna do. We just faced off against a horde. We did pretty good. We didn't get a whole lot of loot. And I still need to do something about this. So I figured since I have to do something about that, I would show you guys what I was going to do to try and do something about that. I am pretty sure that package is glitched. I don't think you're supposed to be able to set down a package inside an inventory of a vehicle. And the reason for that is because it can bug your stuff out. So what I need to do is set everything down in my inventory and then debug it out of my inventory. Uh, can I drop everything here? Nope. Okay, now what we're gonna do, and I'm gonna show you guys so that you will know in case it happens to you, I think this has probably been fixed since this happened in my inventory because it's been a couple of weeks since it happened. Well, not even a couple of weeks, it's been like a week and there's constant updates on this mod, so it's either that or there's not actually constant updates on the mod, it's just it reading that my files are different because I changed a couple of things, so that's entirely possible too. What I'm going to do is really quickly put you guys uh that's my streaming stuff in case you guys didn't know i'm also a streamer over on the on the twitch um but what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit f1 type in cm we do not need the dm dm is debug menu cm is creative menu and we're gonna put on the creative menu i just hit you and this gives me this awesome little button that says clear inventory which actually gets rid of that so if you wind up with a bugged container because it allowed you to drop it someplace you didn't need to and you accidentally turned the quest in now you know how to get rid of the package um i'm pretty sure if i had picked it up and put it in my inventory before i talked to them they would have taken the package even though it had gone out of my inventory and then back into it but I didn't realize I wasn't carrying it until it was too late. Those were like two different recordings and I completely spaced on needing to put it back in my inventory. But there you go and the way you turn it back on is you just hit the F1 button and type in CM again and the creative menu is gone. As you can see it's not there anymore. Just in case you have a bug in your game and you need to take care of that. Now you know all of my stuff and things are messed up. All of the stuff and things are now chaos. Uh, all right, mix up some concrete. And we need to, yeah, I think what we need to do is we, we need to run to the traders, which, you know, we ran to the traders not long ago, but we need to go ahead and do that again uh, because there has been a restock day and there's a couple of things I can drop off. Do I have any mods to go inside of, let me say. All right, now let's run to the trader because we also need to pick up a mission now that we've taken care of getting rid of the package from the last mission. Um, I do need to make some more gas and I need to get the... Uh, I need to get the drills going again because the, the drills need to keep going this week. So I need to do missions that are closer to home and push the drills. Now the horde base has been painted via the painters. So therefore it has been taken care of, but if any upgrades can be done between now and then, I wouldn't mind having the ability to upgrade a few more blocks. It just means repainting a couple of sections, but every little bit helps on that. The painters only repaired blocks, so, but I, I actually think the, the base is doing great. The base is definitely doing Put great. Put away your weapon unless you'd like to die in my store. Uh, yeah, right. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You keep talking that crap, right? You're not interested. Oh, I should have sold that one first. Oh, man. Okay, I will have to run to gens, and I should have taken that. I had it in my inventory, and I didn't take it. I should have taken it. Just the job for a the cathedral, like you. we just did that one not long well, ago, but, uh, the, the central, central hall? Yeah, sure. We'll make up words. We'll, we'll call it whatever we want to. We did that one already, uh, a lot sooner or whatever. Let me run to Jen's and see what she's got as far as missions and we'll go ahead and pelt out a couple of missions for the first couple of days and see if we can't get ourselves at least one mission tier 5 because I do want to do one of those before our day 49 horde and see how that goes assuming we can actually get ourselves up to tier 5s. I did kind of spend an entire week out just roaming around doing my own thing without doing any missions so... 
Hopefully I can find a couple of vehicles. I have been low on the production of gas because of my long trip for a week. Well, aren't you a sight for sore eyes? Hello, Jen. What can I get you? I wanted to sell you that and see if you had anything cool. Yeah, apparently now, that's that it. was a good deal. All right, you me. also have tier four. I'm a doctor. I would love to give you a job. We already did the mortician's so house. If you do this for me, I've got just the job for someone with oh, your man, talent. Oh man, the Fantastic. mortician's house again. Hope to see you soon. Oh man, oh man, Scoob. Uh, speaking of which, I took my mod out of here, and I, I got another mod, but I never put it in here. I need to go grab that before I use up too much more gas. Resource management. Uh, speaking of that, can I make any more of the mods? Hang on. I took all of my steel. Uh, yeah, I used up all of my steel. So let me drop you in here and let me see if I can do any more vehicle mods right quick. Ooh, drum magazine mod though. I I'm on the wrong one. <laughs> uh, uh, craft me one of those. I should not have done that. Um, uh, mods. Craft me one of those. Yeah, the supercharger I still don't have. Okay. Uh, while I am home... Wait, have I... Yes, I've made more of these. Ooh, and I have more of this. I need to get some more... What, maybe some 762? Hold on, can I do bulk on that? Bleh. 762. AP. No, I cannot do bulk on that. What if I go ahead and do some... Shotgun round bolt, because I know I can do that one. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that one. And I probably should take a bit of AP ammo with me, just in case I run across another one of those demos. Alright, this mission is very close, and we did it not long ago, but it's got a whole downstairs full of books, so... Let's get those books. I am searching for the super corn recipe. That's that's like the main thing I am after. Okay, now then. Now we can do the fetch. There we go. Zombie speed has been upgraded. Knock knock, housekeeping. Yeah, I don't want to fall down there. Bleh. Okay, they're gonna come up here to me. Nice. Blah. Nope. Nope. You're lying. There you go. Come down here, dude. Oh, he got pushed. <laughs> All right. I mean, that works. I can't. I got. I got stamina. There we go. Come on down here, dude. Last time I forgot this. Where'd my blocks go? Oh no, did I set down my blocks? I so totally set down my blocks and forgot to do this. Okay, alright. Well, we're gonna take care of that real quick then. I hope I didn't just pick up the whole stack and set them in a side of a forge. I was not even thinking about that. Well, oh, I can get to it like this. Hang on. Nope. There we go. Um, do I have that one? Yes, I do. This one doesn't have it, but I don't think... Yeah, I don't have an extra spot for it, so it's fine. Okay, now, the books. The Tactical Warfare times three... Motor tools, wiring 101, we do not need the handgun, uh, scrapping for fun times two, we got two pieces of paper, I don't need any of these. Okay, let's go. There we go, I have helped as much as I plan on helping. Hey! Okay, okay, slow down, slow down, lady. 
<laughs> you missed. Nope. Wait a minute, I'm trying to get my stamina back. He's going to explode. Nope. Oh, by the way, just uh, just to have this said here, had someone getting on to me for using a hammer saying I was trying to be Simon from Neebs Gaming. First off, I don't think that there's a way in hell that my thighs look as good as Simon's character's thighs can look. But secondly, I am doing a hammer run, which means if I'm not using the hammer, then I'm not doing a hammer run, so it kind of defeats the purpose. Now, am I good with the hammer? No. I, I, I as much stated that the last time I got stuck with a hammer and said that the reason why I was going to do a hammer is so I could get better with it. So, not using the hammer would defeat the purpose of me doing a hammer playthrough. So I do apologize if you don't wish to watch me get my face smacked in whilst I'm trying to wield this big ass hammer, but it's kind of the point. I'm trying not to make the game easy, you know what I'm saying? Come on out of there. Besides, this is the reason why I put my character in heavy armor. I knew this was going to be a thing. Hey! Oh boy. Okay. Then. Just knocked down a whole bunch of people. Come on over here. Dude has a weapon. Dude has a weapon. <laughs> no! He's going to explode. Let's just bury him. Okay. Let's not use up all of the ammo in the world. Another good reason to actually use your melee weapon, even if it's going to be hard and you're going to get smacked around a little bit, is still use your melee weapon to conserve on ammo so you're not spending all of your time crafting. I don't know if it's not evident at this point. I don't like mining for resources because it's time consuming. And time consuming as in it actually takes time out of the video because I'm not going to show it. So the video is going to be shorter. If I can find a way of making more content for you guys to actually watch, I would much prefer to do that. So if me using the hammer keeps me from having to mine for stuff to make more ammo, I'm going to do it. Even if it means me getting smacked in the face a couple of times because, you know, I can make healing stuff pretty easily. I wish to have this bag. Uh, uh. There we go. All the way down here. Okay. Not to mention, you can't tell it's not funny to smack these guys over. You just have not lived until you smack the zombie head off. Nope, 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 you're not allowed to explode. I just tried to reload this. <laughs> Don't even worry about it. It's fine. It needed to be reloaded. Alright, that's just a regular hoodie dude, but can I hit him through that? No. Okay. She's got a firing pan, which means she's got extra health, but she probably has less than everybody else, so... Ow, oh, man. Don't do it. Ow. Whoa, that was a hard slap, dude. There we go. Oh, yep, I'm gonna take the door out. Nope. Ow, and he still got me. Where are you going? Yeah, I don't really need to be running closer to you guys. You guys are more or less getting here. Quit. There we go. 
All right. Has anybody got any stuff for me? Any ammo that I can sell and buy the ammo that I want? There we go. My package. Nice. Make sure I do not set that inside the vehicle this time. Are there books up here? Oh no, they replaced all of the bookshelves up here. Uh, tactical Warfare. Batters up. Tactical Warfare. I will take that batters up and sell it. Hello. She's being creepy down there. I'll stand back up first. Okay. <laughs> See, like that. You never use a hammer and knock a zombie's head off its shoulders and watch it go flying. You have just not lived. I'm just saying. I'm not saying the hammer is my favorite weapon. It is most certainly not. I much prefer the club. Because uh, it has the speed of a machete, but the oomph of a hammer. So it's like the in-between melee weapon. So that one is my favorite. I really like the, the baseball bat. It's got the proper... Actually, if we want to get technical, my favorite melee weapon is the spiked ladle from the wild west mod it's got the perfect thunk it's hilarious i love using it okay we have got the clear and everything so that is all of the bad guys let's go ahead and open everything okay med pile tactical warfare Scrapping for fun. Explosives. Uh, desert Vulture. Reloading. Tactical Warfare. I mean, yeah, there's some ammo in here. I'm actually... I actually need to go ahead and read one of the Fluffy things. And just keep a handful of those on me at all times. Because Fluffy with the hammer is like one of the ones that I can definitely get on a usual basis. Because it's the weapon I am running with. Or... The BAM with the shotgun. Assuming it's not the pump shotgun you have to use. It might be the pump shotgun you have to use. I have to look at that one. It's congratulations. Here's your reward, sucker. High grade steel pen. Uh, magazine bundle. Her motherfucker. I've got work. Yeah. Tyler Manor. You don't mind. Uh, this one is an infested, which means it's actually a tier three. <laughs> it's a tier three, but it'll have a whole bunch of extra bad guys and an extra loot container. Which is not the best, but it is something different because I have been looting the exact same type of buildings for a while. Okay. Well, screw that one haystack in particular. We go in there. We go in here. I say we go in here. Hi. Shh. I'm trying to be stealthy, dude. Wakey, wakey. Usually somebody in here too. Okay. Kill two hundred zombies. Okay, just knock this dude down. Wait for him to stand back up because for some reason they don't take damage properly whenever they're trying to get up. Knock knock. So it's better just to wait for them to stand up. take you out because you'll explode. You and I can go mano a mano with the big weapons. There we go. That reloaded. I think we're good. Was she dead? No. <laughs> now she is. Come on up here, dude. I just deflated his noggin. Yeah, I'll get that lucky looter in so that I can get that loot faster. Uh, knife guy we don't need and a tier 5 compound bow. Uh, I want to make them a way to get up to me that way. They don't sit in here and beat up my loot. Alright, come on up here guys.
go. Knock some people down. Ow. I just stepped on somebody to hit somebody else. That did not work out so great. Ow. I have suffered an abrasion. Okay. I have to ask both of you to sit down. Somebody is fixing to explode, I think. Yeah. <laughs> he took his legs off. Ew. Tactical warfare. Tactical warfare. Don't need that. bunch of different types of ammo and a whole bunch of crap to be honest with you is what I'm finding what else um... and a medical journal hang on let's go ahead and make some more building blocks I'm sure actually no I need that um I'm sure I will find a use for I forgot what I was going to say. I popped something out of my inventory for like a split second and I'm like, I just lost my brains. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, I'm sure I can make it back to the traders. I'm done. Uh, this way. Actually, take my blocks. Take the blocks. We got ourselves a real life hero, and now he wants to be paid. I'm not sure exactly what kind of hero you think I am, but payment is an option. I did not mean to sell the machine gun stuff, because I might need that. Job. I guess you ain't all that A tier six all. axe. We'll take that. Uh I'll still take the this, yeah. Wow. <laughs> I didn't get any iron on that one. Only one out of my seven drills actually gave me iron at all. There we go. $2,000 for that axe. Alright, that one is definitely going to be worth taking my learning elixir for. Actually, if I can find some stuff for this as well. Aha. You are my test subject. Ooh, and the dong on that too. Can you put spikes in it too? Bleh. Can you put spikes in it too? Oh, that looks mean. <laughs> uh, if I play this mod again, which will likely happen, I'm gonna have to run with the clubs so that I can play with that one. That looks fun. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for this episode. I'm going to get ourselves healed up, get this infection taken care of, get some food, and get ready for the next one. I will see you then. You have a wonderful day. Open up and you stay shiny. Bye.